some people in the church brought a lady to me and said, uh, this so-and-so and introduced me. She and her husband had been missionaries to Mexico for 40 years. 40 years. And so I'm talking to her and I said, is there anything I can, I can pray with you about? And she said, yeah. She said, um, two months ago, uh, I was, something happened with our visas and I was ordered to leave Mexico after 40 years. And my husband uh, has to, had to stay. And there's something wrong and they won't let him out and they won't let me back in. So we've been apart for two months. Uh, could you pray about that? Well, we, we have a man in our church named Juan Hernandez that ran the campaign for Vicente Fox to be elected president. And at that time, Vicente Fox was president. As a matter of fact, President Fox was the first president of Mexico not elected from the Communist Party in 72 years. And Juan led him to Jesus Christ. And he's a believer. And then Juan led 13 out of 24 cabinet members to Christ. And he, member of our church. And uh, so uh, I thought to myself, hey, maybe Juan could, could do something to help. So I said, give me your name and your number, your information, your contact info. There's someone in our church, and I think he might be able to help. So the next service, this couple came up to me, and they introduced themselves, and his name's Jose. And he said, I'm Juan Hernandez's cousin. And I said, oh, I said, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get in touch with Juan. I don't know if he's in town or not this weekend. And um, I said, there's, and so I told him the story. I said, there's a lady, that's a problem with the visa, and um, so that's why I'm trying to talk to Juan. And Jose said, I will take care of it. And uh, I said, um, really? And uh, I said, are you, are you, do you have some contacts? He said, I'm the Minister of Immigration for Mexico. <laughs> I said, really? And so then I, I thought, well, you know, it's the first time I've ever met the guy, you know, and I don't want to impose. So I said, well, listen, I said, you know, uh, I mean, if, if you run into any problems, you know, you know, I was just trying to kind of let him off the hook. And I'll never forget, he looked me right now and he said, I will not run into any problems. I will take care of it. <laughs> he understood the power that he had. He also understood what his power was for. And this was on Sunday, uh, that, that weekend, on Monday, he had his visa. And he came home, and they had a, and, and within a year, after them being home and having a furlough, the husband went to be with the Lord. And I remember thinking about how God had arranged for them to be together that last year of his life. But here's what I want to say to you. I feel like I have a prophetic word for you. Remember where all power comes from. All power comes from God. So I, I would like to say something to each of you right now. This is from the Lord. Here's what God would like to say to you. I will not have any problems. I will take care of it. I will take care of it.